Are you looking for a vehicle that's four doors, maybe five doors, that's fun to drive and doesn't look like all the others? Stay right with us on Car Coach Reports. Welcome to Car Coach Reports. I'm Lauren Fix, and today we are driving the 2018 Mazda 3 five-door Grand Touring. Lots of numbers and letters mixed in there. But I really love this vehicle because it's not the same as other vehicles. Now, I may say that about a few other brands, but Mazda's always been a brand that I think has been overlooked. And I've said that before in my other Mazda reviews. I really like their product. And the fact that it's built well and people that own them love them. They're loyalists. I owned a Mazda back in the 80s. It was an RX-7. I loved the vehicle. But today, we have new design, new technology, better performance. Let's take it for a drive. Inside the 2018 Mazda 3 five-door Grand Touring, I have to say this compact car should be on every driver's list who's looking to buy a vehicle in this category. It offers athletic handling, good performance, and great brakes. I love the upper scale interior. I'm not a big fan of this head up display. Yes, it works, but I don't know, there's just something about this piece of plastic that really frustrates me. Um, if you're gonna do a head-up display, do one, but don't put this piece of plastic in there. Looking at the navigation screen or the center stack screen, it's no bigger than your iPhone 10 or your Android Galaxy or whatever you're looking at. It's pretty average size. Continuing looking at what's available, you've got your entertainment, it's just a list. I mean, is it good? Is it acceptable? Yes, it does the trick, but it's, I would like to see some colors. I would like to see more in it. But again, I know that Mazda is all about saving money and giving you a lot for your money. And this vehicle starts at $24,000. I think that's pretty cool. Um, fuel economy getting an average around 30 miles a gallon in the city. We have this for a week, so we put it on the highway, we put it on the streets, you know, we do everything that you would do. This vehicle is a great compact car, and I think it's overlooked, which is a shame. I've said that a lot about Mazda. It sh they should have like triple the sales that they have because they really put out a fun car that is a blast to drive. Now this vehicle really doesn't have any options. Typically we get vehicles that are completely loaded, but it has heated seats, both passenger and driver. It has a heated steering wheel, which is important. And yes, it is winter here in Buffalo. And thank you so much Mazda for putting a set of Bridgestone Blizzaks on this car so that when the snow comes down, which we just had a few feet of snow the other day and then it disappeared, I was able to get through the road safely. And thank goodness, because this vehicle is not all wheel drive, but being that it's front wheel drive and putting a set of snow tires on, this vehicle can be very safe in the winter. Now, looking in front of you at the gauges, they're very basic. There's nothing more than you need. It's black and white. It tells you, you what you need to know, the temperature outside, how much fuel is left, what's your speed, how many miles are on the car. There's not a lot of information, but when you're buying a $24,000 compact car, typically they're just vehicles and they're okay this car is really unique. It has an edgy look to it. And if you're looking for something different than what everybody else is driving in this category, the Mazda 3 five-door Grand Touring is really worth taking for a spin. As far as seating comfort, thumbs down. No lumbar, both driver and passenger side. Very sad and disappointing. Visibility is really good. Out the back, not so great because it's smaller because it is a hatchback. But as far as up front on the sides and the side view mirrors, you can see everything that you need to see. When you're looking at safety and you're looking at technology, safety, absolutely at the top, IIHS Top Safety Pick Plus. That's huge. And if you're looking for a car for a new driver or you want something that's safe, this Mazda 3 should be on your list. I think that's a huge factor that is definitely overlooked. I talk about safety all the time and why it's important. Also check out our four minute Fridays where we do cover a lot of things that are new, whether it be safety and things that affect your automotive world. There'll be links for that down below as well. Overall, the Mazda 3 five door is a fun car. It's got a pretty upscale interior and compared to the competition in this category, it beats it on many fronts. So make sure to check out the reviews that we've driven of competitor vehicles as well. So you're probably questioning, what's the performance like? What's the brakes like? Well, the brakes are good. They're well-designed. Again, safety is an important factor when it comes to Mazda. Handling, oh my gosh, 
What a fun car to drive, which is not what I would say about most compact cars. And as far as performance, it's acceptable. We're looking at an engine that does exactly what you want it to do, getting you from point A to point B, but not in a boring way, in a fun way. And I have to say, they've done a great job, Mazda, on that. One last thing, when it comes to audio, this is a Bose sound system. So you've got a really good sound system that's available out there. And it does have, of course, connectivity if you want Apple CarPlay, Android Auto. That should be pretty standard in my eyes. Just, I think lumbar should be. I mean, how much does it really cost? I understand it's a $24,000 car, but I want you to put the conversation down below. What do you think? Is lumbar worth it? Would you buy a car that doesn't have it? I don't know. I want to know what you think. Actually, I do kind of know because I get your feedback from your other things. And thanks so much for all the comments on my cool glasses as well. If you like this review, make sure to hit the subscribe button next to it's a little bell. Click on that and it'll allow you to know when we post new reviews, which is every Monday and Thursday, as well as breaking news and some really cool car shows and some cool destinations along our channel. Check out our Patreon page as well. We appreciate your support. Follow us on all forms of social media. There are links down below. And like I said, check out the competition. We've driven it. We've checked it out for you. Remember, seating comfort, visibility, safety, performance, and technology, that's all up to you. Thanks so much for watching. This is Car Coach Reports, and I'm Lauren Fix. Take care. We'll see you next time. We go to the grocery store. You know, we drive around the school areas. We just live life. And in this vehicle, this is a great early start. This vehicle is great vehicle if you're looking for a first car, maybe, you know, you're...